Welcome to the Corp Vault channel. In this video, we will discuss the second method of how to perform upgrade of Com Vault from version 10 to version 11. Please like, share, comment, subscribe for more videos, and you can follow us on Instagram. For this video, we will install Com Vault version 11 software, and during the install, we will use existing database and rebuild production com serve database before we proceed we recommend you to go through our other video com vault standard in house upgrade from version 10 to version 11 to know the pre checks that are needed to be taken care before you proceed with the actual upgrade ensure to take the disaster recovery backup note down the set id and verify the contents of it Open programs and features, and verify there is no Com Vault software installed on the server. Browse to the location where version 11 Com Vault software is located. Run setup.exe with admin privileges. Please choose appropriate language and click next to continue accept the convault license agreement and click next to proceed select install package on this computer select desired packages Once done, click next to continue. Stages are highlighted for your attention. Installing required prerequisite. Checking installed prerequisites. By default, Com Vault installation path is in drive C, you can browse and install it on any other drive. As per Com Vault recommendation, index cache should be on dedicated fixed drive. Click Yes on the pop up window. By default, Microsoft SQL Database Engine install path is Drive C, but you can change it if you would like. By default, ComServe Database path is Drive C, change it to another drive where there is enough free space. For this video, we will keep the disaster recovery path local, but recommend it as network path. As selected path is not empty it's giving error, ignore it. As we are not using any proxy, we will skip it. Please pay attention to selected packages, required packages, and third party software in the installation summary. These are the packages that will be installed on the server. During preparing installation, it is checking for any already installed components. Acquiring MongoDB Installing MongoDB Installing Python Installing Python objects Installing Microsoft SQL, CLR functions Installing Microsoft SQL, Management Objects Installing IIS Server Roles Installing .NET Installing Standard Microsoft SQL Server Preparing Install Installing file system core
Installing ComServe. Installing Workflow Engine. Installing Media Agent. Installing Storage Accelerator. Installing Index Store. Installing Web Server. Installing Content Extractor. Installing Index Gateway. Installing VSS Provider. Installing VSS Hardware Provider. Installing ComCell Console. Installing File System. Installing Virtual Server. Installing Command Center. Installing Metric Server. Installing MongoDB. Installing Messaging Queue. Extracting ZIP files. Installing hotfixes. Pre-configuring VSS provider and VSS hardware provider. Configuring web alias and com cell console. Pre-configuring Windows file system agent. Pre-configuring diagnostics and usage server. Initializing configuration phase. Verify client name and the host name. Ensure host name is backup FQDN. If you wish to disable firewall, select yes here. In the database install option, we can create or use existing database. Let's choose use existing database. Select the DBs that were in Convault version 10. If you have a version 11 license file you can enable the option below and select it. Once done, click next to proceed. Browse and select the databases. Choose the option to rebuild production com serve database. Stage database is equal to just restoring the database without any changes made to it. Ideally used for testing purposes. Setting SQL Server Memory Creating SQL Admin Account Creating DSN Restoring ComServe Database Updating Client Information on ComServe
starting com vault services. Convault upgrade completed successfully. Do subscribe for more videos. Thank you.